Hello, you're watching FYI Weddings. My name is Jeffrey Horn and I'm your host. We are here today with the lovely Robin Jackson, who is the manager at Lulu's Bridal. Welcome. Thank you. Let's talk a little bit about undergarments. I know that mm -hmm. a lot of young women probably have never worn a gown that is so uh, constructed. Mm -hmm. And um, sometimes undergarments are a little bit um, of an afterthought, but they're really actually very important with bridal. Yes, they are very important. Um, I've always, when I, because I used to work in alterations, and I used to always tell the bride that when you have a very expensive dress on, you have to have the right undergarments on to hold the dress in place and to make it look best, because you're in that garment all day. You're in that dress all day, and you want to just make sure the undergarments are right. We definitely promote bustiers here. We think it's best on your, it's like when you're a little girl and you're getting dressed for Easter Sunday. You had all the right outer garments, but you also had all the right undergarments on. You had your slip and your undershirt and whatever else. But um, I think some of the girls have gotten away from that. So we always encourage if your gown needs a bustier, it helps keep it in place, especially a strapless -like gown, it helps keep it up. Um, some of the girls are smaller A or B cups and they don't really have to have a bustier and we put what we call cookies inside of the dress. But undergarments are very important. We do believe in petticoats. We even have trumpet petticoats to keep your gown looking like that Barbie doll look all day. You want to stay fresh all day. And in order to do that, you have to have the proper undergarments. Right. There's one term that I was shocked when I first started um, hanging around the bridal world and that was horsehair. And it sometimes scares brides when they hear the term. Can you explain what it is and how it has nothing to do with the horse? It has nothing to do with the horse. <laughs> it's just very uh, stiff trim that you put on the um, you can put on the hem of the gown, and it keeps it flared out. It just keeps it in shape. Um, it's usually done on tulle. It can be done on some of the other fabrics also, but it just keeps it nice and rippled and very pretty, and stand out very nicely. I've had a wonderful time chatting with you, Robin. So that's Robin Jackson. My name is Jeffrey Horn, your host. Thank you for joining us for FYI Weddings.